Hey everyone, here we are in my garage again. Uh, this is my first video that I'm making about my hydroponics setup. I decided to do hydroponics because I wanted to grow peppers. And I really didn't want to do it outside because of all the outside factors like rabbits and birds and squirrels and whatever might fuck with the plants and kill them. So I'm um, there's a local hydroponics supply store nearby and I went and I bought this cool big tray. It's called a uh, some kind of X like an X tray. X trays and then I've got a T5 lighting. It's just a dual bulb fixture. And then Got some timers, ones to control the lighting, the others to control the pump that pumps the water up to the top. So yes, this is an ebb and flow or a fill and drain style hydroponic system. These little things right here, these are clay. And they've been like super hardened, so they're like little hollow little rocks. And they, they're supposed to be real, t real sterile and they, uh, and it looks like cocoa puffs. It's like cereal, you f and this thing fills up with water. And uh, about four times a day, four to five, maybe even six times a day, it's going to fill up to with water, and then the pump's going to shut off, and it's going to all drain back down into the sump. This is uh, my sump. Got the water coming right through there, down to the sump, and uh, that's where all the water's in. Uh, I'm using this stuff called Dynagro Liquid Grow. Um, it's fertilizer, pretty much. And you can put that in the water, a couple teaspoons, and let it grow. Here's stones, those things I'm using. It's called Hydra Stones. Uh, that's my setup. Pretty cool. These are just regular peppers from uh, from Walmart. I bought in the seed thing, but the guy at the the store. Apparently, all those guys. I I assumed they all grew pot because it looks like a major pothead store. But um, they're actually. Well, I'm sure they they probably might. I don't know. But they're also into growing peppers, and uh, they gave me some type of pepper called a jigsaw. And this jigsaw is supposedly going to be the world's hottest pepper next year when they go to competition. It's a hybrid that someone here in Melbourne, Florida designed and uh, he told me if I cut this pepper open I can plant the seeds and have the future world's most hottest pepper. Anyways, have a wonderful evening.